ready? I'll be ready. What's up, Frigate Chasers? This video is a continuation of our third day sailing the McGregor 26X and our Learning to Sail series. We shove off from Indian Creek Marina at Mark Twain Lake and sail our way to Black Jack Marina where we are welcomed by the Mark Twain Lake Sailing Association. This video is kind of long, but it's mostly for our personal learning experience and entertainment value. But if you are learning to sail like us, you could find our mistakes helpful or comical. So, enjoy! So, the gust got a little wild earlier, so we're just running jib again for a little bit. Uh-oh, bikini shots. If you enjoyed long static shots, you know, not a lot of skipping around, just one angle for hours, we could do that. We have hours worth of content of just single mounted shots that we could make like an ASMR video for you guys or whatever. Let us know if you're into that. We'll get started on those later. This, this thing came undone up there apparently. Yeah. This is hell. Huh? Yep, you done it. I didn't do shit. He doesn't know. No, I do know. It's changed the shape of the sail, but why did it come undone up there? Uh, the threads probably ripped out. Yeah, well, I mean, we're going to have to tack to get anywhere. Well, that's going to put us straight back over there.
massive rock sticking out right over there? Uh, sure is. I'm gonna try to go around it. A few more of those. Check it out to go around it or between it. I think let's go ahead and uh, attack. Shoot. Yeah. All right. Let's see what we can do here. Attacking. Are we? Uh, we want to go that way. <laughs> we'll pick up the speed. Alright, we're going to tagging. That one's not on. Nah, I'm pointing at the point. Sign, sign, everywhere the signs. Spelling, we want to know what they stand for. Talking about my scenery. That's my mind. Woo! Now we're scooting. How fast we're going, I have not a clue. What is the term for the silk? That silking? Heel. Heel, isn't it? I guess so. Should we go explore that cave and buy the bluff over there? We might find gold. We're off such a good heel. Well, Valerie, how do you feel about sailing so far? <laughs> I'm loving it. Yeah? You haven't fallen out yet. <laughs> yeah, falling out would be bad. <laughs> What's it mean when the jib is doing a bunch of fluttering? See, so tighten it up or what? I don't know. It's scooting us along pretty good, so I'm not worried about it. It's doing a good job. I can't tighten it anymore.
Actually, no, that's the right thing. Whoa! Oh, man. I know where oh, that camera is catching that angle. Maybe one of those. I don't know. All right, it's possible. Just broke wind. Ah, breaking wind. That is another boat name we have considered. Let us know. Go ahead and vote. We're between Not a Clue, Ed's Blister, and Breaking Wind at this point. Go ahead and vote. Let us know what you think in the comments down below. Thanks for watching. Wang on wang. Yeah. The problem is, front doing stuff like this, the ships have to use the whip on. Mm -hmm. Right, we're just sitting dead now. Sneaking. Higher keep to harvest the wheat, plant those wheat beans, and we can head on down to the keys. Or back when it was cute. We're actually getting it from the side now, anyway. Spreader. bother trying to plant anything for June next year. Ridiculous. Struggle, struggle, struggle. I'm gonna get I'm gonna get a brand new planter, great big wide 40 foot brand new planter so we ain't gotta do worry about nothing. So go out and spray, let it die, wait for things to get dry. Well, like I said it's kind of changing around. It's not really I mean I could I could Crank the starboard some and head more into the wind pump to pick up a little speed, but we're still doing three and a half knots, so that's not bad. This is what you call motor sailing.
Yeah, we just keep getting uh, periods of zero wind here. I guess that's Missouri sailing though, right? You either get a gust or you get nothing. Apparently we've got autopilot. so it's the first time I've heard it, but you can hear the sound of the water down in the, in the tube where the cable goes down to the keel. There you go. Oh. I think it was more than that when we looked at it. Yeah, I think the beam on that one was nine something. 32 feet. Well, we could legit move that one ourselves then if we had the proper trailer. I mean, it'd take, you know, it wouldn't be easy like this one. Right. And the wind is dead again. Well, I wish I knew how much wind we had. Uh, it says we're doing three knots. We're kind of going slightly downwind at the moment. I don't know if I could, can believe an iPhone app with the correct speed, but I don't know. According to the bubbles in the water, we're going decent speed. But yeah, we're about ready to make a turn. This is gonna put it back on the beam for sure. Take us to Blackjack Marina. So, uh, Oh, no, sorry, all the cool kids are saying, you! I miss the great big winds and big waves that splash you in the face. Like last time. I was <laughs> if 
Put your back against the down. Huh? I think your key is to put your back against the downhill side. And your feet this direction. I mean your feet on the sink and your back against the down on the port side. That's no wind. I'm turned all the way to the right at the moment. <laughs> don't know, once, you, once you stop, you have absolutely no rudder control whatsoever. <sighs> we ain't got shit. I'll go wherever we do got shit. like it's gonna miss us. What? That rain cloud coming in up over there. Well, it, it's probably going through at home. I'll check here or not. I'm thinking it needs, well, well, we need to make some sort of cubbies up there to hold stuff, but they also need to double as backrest. So they need to be like a hard shell kind of a creation there that's cushioned, you know what I mean? So you can lean up against it to get put stuff inside of it. Until somebody throws it with everybody's shit in it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so funny, I parted. <laughs> hey, that gave us an extra uh, knot. Uh, We're getting closer to the marina. Same.
about to move. Okay, I don't know where we want to go. This is Kevin, and this is Myron. They are the official Mark Twain Lake Welcoming Committee. They gave us a quick tour of the marina, took us for a dock walk, and Myron even gave us a tour of his boat. Come on aboard. Oh, for real? Yeah. All right. Come on down. This thing's awesome. Got most stuff packed up and ready got to a, go home. But got a big one. What kind of boat is this? Hunter. A hunter. Okay. An eighty-four Hunter. Nice. She, 30, uh, Thirty-four foot. We we actually looked at a thirty-two foot Hunter Vision. Okay. Yeah, the has, one with the big. Yeah. Yeah, like yeah and, and no rigging. Yeah. See, I got a berth back there and a and a, a V berth. Cool. And so much room. Yeah. Nice, man. <laughs> Probably hears that a lot. <laughs> That's it, guys, and thanks for watching. Be sure to give us a big thumbs up for our efforts. Frigate out.